Hello, hello, ladies and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of East 8 Lacrimosa of Donna. And we have a raid to do. Can we fortify anymore? Let's increase the level. Awesome. Roger, give me a sec. Let's increase the level of these two. All finished. These we can't do anything with. Catapult we can't do anything with. And the gong we can't do anything with. Alright. Let's begin the raid. Good to go. What? I guess let's do this. Leave it to me. Recommended level 33, and we are like 30, 31. I won't let them pass. Right, where will they come from? Right. Wow, this feels easy. Don't underestimate me. Here's a little gift for the beast. Doggy squad doing bad. Doggy squad doing bad. That's like one shot. Alright, got it! And that was a primordial. Nothing did break. I think we actually kept everything intact and we didn't lose any health. So I would say we did pretty freaking good. Okay. No, 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 they're damaging it! Got it. We did get a little damage on one of the baits though. Other than that, I feel like we did pretty good. Alright. Everyone 
Well, it seems like we lost one of the barricades. Uh, didn't even even mean to do that. Don't underestimate me. All right. Yeah, we lost two barricades. <sighs> Damn. Wave four. Coming from up here. Oh, damn, and also. Got it. All right, any more? <sighs> well, nothing else is broken. There is a bait that is just about broken, though. Final wave. Defeat the beast leader. Ouch. Big one, coming through! 
Oh. Ouch. Well, he destroyed the bait. Easier said than done. Wow, this thing is killing everything we got. Alright, got it. But it destroyed four baits. And <sighs> Man. Well, at least we didn't die. I mean, I think my vampiric powers are even better now. Because um, I didn't lose any health. Ninety five point one full kill rate. That looks pretty darn good, though. What a great job. Yeah, nay. I call that pretty good. So dodgy, how did you do? Whores you get an S. They're always better than us. Wait, we got Sparkling Leaf? Oh yeah, it's the mucus we need. Totally forgot about that. It's working. Did we kill it? No. I think we just heard it. Uh -huh. Or? It would seem this beast has finally fallen. <laughs> He's adorable. All right, you did it, guys. Oh, 
Afterwards, the village held a small celebration to celebrate their victory. The castaway spirits had been renewed in light of their triumph over the primordial menace. Upon his return, Adol was nearly overwhelmed as a sea of jubilant voices washed over him. Though the occasional was less formal for Alexia was used to, she didn't seem to mind at all. Sahad and Ricotta held hands and danced the night away. <laughs> Adorable! However, we're still stuck on this island. Perhaps the real trial starts now. Thinking that, Adol crawled into bed and fell into a deep sleep for the first time in a long while. So are we gonna play as Donna? Nope. Are you okay, Sahad? Ow, my head's killing me. So your head is evil? <laughs> well, I have been told that I ain't quite right upstairs. Gah, my head from it. <laughs> Leave him alone, Ricotta. My word. This is what you get for drinking too much. Ugh, sorry. Couldn't help myself. Still, that was the first time I had ever seen everyone so happy and jubilant. It was a very pleasant experience. <laughs> you got air, right? When everyone's happy, I'm happy. Now that we know Oshikakum weapons are effective against Primordials, we should uh, leave for Indamre at once, at all. Yeah, we gotta find Rikala's father. Come on, come on, let's go! <laughs> Adorable. Alright, so this is our destination. It seems like this is the closest point that we got. Oh yeah, I remember this place. Well, one thing for sure, he didn't come back here. You see, he's dead as a doornail. Oh, is there something here? There's a kitty here! Mishishi! Hey, I've seen this weirdo before. The, this creature... Is the type of primordial? I think I saw one, um, one in the Castile region before. R really? I actually know what this creature is. I recognize this cute ear tail and face from my father's old research materials. It's an exclusive creature, but whenever it appears, it brings joy to those it meets. As I recall, it's called a Mishi. Mishi? That's this weirdo's name? Hmm, first I heard of it. Oh, it's hungry. 
You hungry or something? Want some fish? Fruit, maybe? Mishishi. Mishishi. He says I'm sick of eating fish and fruit. You can understand it? <laughs> Just a teensy bit. <laughs> Impressive. So if I don't... If I don't want fish or fruit, should we give it a cooked meal? Mishishi! He says I'd love to try it. That's cooking something to eat. I'm not opposed to the idea. <laughs> Alright, let's feed it. Alright, I think I actually have something. Mishishi. Mishishi stares at you longingly. Alright, how about one of these? Om nom nom. Mishishi. Mishi quickly devoured the food. Mishishi. Looks like it's still hungry. Alright, how about the fish soup? Nom 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 nom. Mishishi. Mishishi quickly devoured the food. It looks satisfied now. Alright, got some cure berries. Cool. Okay, doesn't seem to be anything else here, so I guess we'll continue this way. Um, tell you what, though, I think we're gonna do that in the next episode. I'm ending this one off here. I do hope you've enjoyed it, and I hope to see y'all in the next one. Until then, bye bye.